breaking news. At least 12 people are shot as gunmen open fire at a Mother's Day second line. Monica Hernandez is live near the scene of that shooting. She just spoke with NOPD Superintendent Ronald Surpass and joins us now with more on what happened. Monica. Well, Katie, we're here on Frenchman Street, and you can see that the crime scene tape that was on this street has since been taken down, but there's still a very large police presence here on the corner of North Villery and Frenchman Street, where that shooting happened just over three hours ago. Detectives are out in full force knocking on doors, trying to figure out if anyone in the neighborhood knows anything about this disturbing Mother's Day shooting. Police comb through a neighborhood stricken by violence on what should have been a joyous celebration. Hundreds were in the crowd at the annual Mother's Day Second Line Parade when shots rang out, striking a dozen people. The youngest victim was just 10 years old. She is said to be in good condition. Those enjoying the parade are in shock. My family was second line in the parade, and then all of a sudden it just stopped, and everybody started running and running and running, and we were wondering what was going on. And they shooting, and they say children were shot and everything. It's just time to stop with the violence. It's not cool. It's Mother's Day. Who want to lose a child on Mother's Day? EMS reports three people are in critical condition, but no one was killed. One neighbor saw victims collapse in front of her. I just opened my door today, and two guys just collapsed right down my steps. You know, and me and my daughter did the best thing we can to revive them. You know, and I think we helped save another life today. Police say more than 10 officers were patrolling the second line. They saw three men run from the scene after shots rang out down Frenchman Street toward Claiborne Avenue. The gunmen are still on the loose. These are unusual circumstances. We have second lines that occur in the city of New Orleans virtually every weekend at this time of the year. We had a full complement of police officers. Uh, it appears that these two or three people, just for a reason unknown to us, started shooting at, towards, or in the crowd. It was over in just a, a couple seconds. Police were everywhere. It's the area's second shooting in a week. Now neighbors are pleading, stop the violence. I don't like this to happen while here. And then on the Mother's Day and the children involved with it too. You know why we can't have peace. Now, there were more victims than just the shooting victim. In fact, police tell us that an elderly woman was taken to the hospital as well after she fell in the aftermath of the shooting. Now, police do have a description on one of those suspects. They say that he is a dark-skinned male, 18 to 22 years old, with short hair, wearing a white shirt and blue jeans. No other information on the other suspects, though. If you have any information, call Crime Stoppers. That number is 822-1111. Reporting live from the 7th Ward, Monica Hernandez, Eyewitness News. News. Katie. Monica, 